pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hey West Ottawa, I'm Chuck. And I'm Riley. Out of 43 girls in the West Ottawa Women's Cross Country Team, Kira Dora may not stand out for her speed, but she stands out for her heart. She is just one of the most hardworking and just passionate about everything that she invests in. She's just one of the most passionate people that we have on the team. But this isn't the only team she's on. Why did you join wrestling? Um, I tried fight sports before and I thought they were really fun um, and I wanted to try them in a the school setting. Uh, but on top of that, I'd heard that wrestling had the hardest conditioning of any of West Ottawa school sports and I wanted to improve myself, you know, just to get in better shape. That's right. Kira's part of a rare group, female wrestling. Kira does everything that we ask of her. Uh, it's definitely, wrestling is a very grueling physical and mental sport and uh, she hasn't backed down from anything and uh, she actually does, you know, training stuff the year round as well as too, so she doesn't back down from any challenges we give her. So she's very mentally tough, physically tough. We have probably average probably one, two girls every year. A few girls in the past that actually went on to compete uh, at the uh, girls' uh, state event. Hopefully I'd like to see Kira at that state final. And also because I was planning to enlist in the Marine Corps. When she sets a goal, she works to achieve it. Do you think Kira has a taste to become Marine? Oh yeah, she, um, with her hard work and her passion and her commitment, there's no doubt that anything she sets her mind to, she's going to be able to accomplish. I think if you can survive a West Ottawa wrestling practice, you can most certainly be a Marine. Whoa Pong meets every Tuesday in the LGI room from 3 to 4. Show up and bring your paddle. Everyone is welcome. Do you play trading card games? Game Club will be hosting these games on January 6th from 3 to 4.30 p.m. in room 209 South. Please bring cards to play and trade with. Contact Jesse Grover or Jamison Ray if you have questions. Don't forget your Pokeballs. Mrs. Engel was interviewed about the Creative Writing Club to share more information about it. Let's check it out. What inspired Creative Writing Club? Mr. Wilkinson and I both did the Lake Michigan Writing Project through Grand Valley State University. And through that project, we talked with other English teachers around West Michigan about how we can encourage student writing. And both of us kind of came to the conclusion that we need to give more opportunities to students who have a passion for writing. How often will the club meet? We will meet twice a month, so every other Thursday from 3 to 4 p.m. in my classroom. What activities will the club members take part in? Everything from just daily writing, getting some ideas on the page, to poetry. But a lot of it is just like encouraging writing and having a safe place to share your ideas. Will there be like any specific competitions at the club? Oh, that will hold? Yeah. None that we have planned yet but there are some ideas in the works, so you'll have to tune in and look out for some things. Anyone is always welcome. We hope you enjoyed our show. We'll see you guys tomorrow.